They said we hold these truths to be self-evident, that all men are created equal. But here in Louisiana and all over the South, Jim Crow never really left, and the remnants of the Confederacy remain. In 1873, when a black man named PBS Pinchback won a U.S. Senate race, he was never seated. They claimed election fraud. The attacks against black people, our right to vote, and participate in this democracy are methodical. Gerrymandered districts are a byproduct of the Confederacy. Our system isn't broken. It's designed to do exactly what it's doing, which is producing measurable inequity. One in 13 black Americans are deprived of the right to vote. One in nine black Americans do not have health insurance. One in three black children live in poverty. It's time to burn what remains of the Confederacy down. I do believe the South will rise again, but this time it'll be on our terms. I'm Gary Chambers and I'm running for the U.S. Senate and I approve this message. In case you missed it, that's Gary Chambers. He's running for Senate in Louisiana, and that has got to be the strongest political ad I have ever seen. There was more substance in that. He had the visuals, and I love it. But he had more substance, more facts in that video than any campaign ad I've ever seen. I follow political news pretty much all day, every day, and there is not a lot that provides uh, any sliver of hope, except for that. We get Gary Chambers and Nina Turner in the Senate and in the House, that's hope right there. Go to Chambers for Louisiana to donate to him.